We need to talk. Yeah? What do we need to talk about? Oh, let me guess. Star Manning. What are you doing here? I had to see you. No, this is this is a bad idea. Why? Is cold around? No, it's bad for me. So he's not here. I, I thought that we agreed that we were going to steer clear of each other. This can't wait. Are you gonna let me in or what? I'm I'm glad you're here. Um, I have some news. Okay, so. Yeah, we could use some good news. So I've got to have me keep that, but uh, uh, but this isn't it. Ted, just spit it out, okay? I am a little short on time. How short? I have a few weeks. At the most. How'd you find me? I just moved in. Now, your brother made sure Star knew where he was. Don't look too excited. Shh, would you keep it down? Hope is napping. How's she doing? She's great. But she's glad to have her mommy back home. Yeah, and her daddy, too. You, you look better. Bullet free since July 9th. Is that the actual bullet? Yeah, they asked me if I wanted to keep it. And you said yes? To remind me how precious life is. No, it gives me mad street cred. I mean, people can be like, what is that? I'm like, it's the cap that they dug out of my gut. What? <laughs> wow, that's great if you're trying to be all gangster. <laughs> yeah, not really. But I guess I'll have to keep it since it reminds me of you. Is that what you're doing here? No. Then why? I don't know. I was out walking and I ended up in the park where we first met. And then I ended up at your front door. Why? Looks like I can't stay away from you. Look, I'm not here to talk about Star. And what? You owe Hannah O'Connor. How you figure that? Look, I know what you did to her. No, other way around. She put me in a hospital, nearly killed me. She can rot for all I care. Well, you almost got your wish. What? Hannah tried to kill herself last night. No way. Um, how can he even know that? You can fight. I, I have to No, no, you so will. I, I, I have No, there's got to be some other treatment that he can do. Well, what exactly did he say? Uh, he said that I am deteriorating. Um, that treatment can't help me, not now. So that's it? We're just supposed to wait? <laughs> no. No. Um, there is one option. One... One really, really good option. Finally, what is it? Um, it's a hospice. Um, Greg told me about a place that has experience in dealing with cases like mine. Okay, they can take very good care of me, and they can keep me comfortable for the next couple weeks. So it's like you wouldn't be in any pain? Not much. It's okay with me, is it okay with yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. Mom, we just want you to be okay. Well, this place sounds like a really excellent facility. They have very good equipment and the best care. They're gonna, they're gonna take care of me and, and they'll know what to do when things... No, 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 when things... we get it. We're on board. It's fine. Yeah. What's the deal? Uh, well, um, Greg said that um, he can make arrangements for me to go whenever I want to go. And when do you want to go? Now. Like tonight? Yeah. Okay, yeah. That means we just have to pack. Yeah, yeah, I can be really fast. Yeah, me too. <clears throat> you don't have to pack. Really, so are you gonna go on a shopping spree once we get there or what? Look, we just have to throw some stuff in a bag. It doesn't matter what we wear, right? I mean, we're gonna be spending all our time with you. Where are we going? Um, I, I can't say. Why is that? 
What? What? Mika. Your father and you, um, you can't come with me. Why won't they let us come to the hospice? That's so stupid, we're your family. You can make them though, right? This has nothing to do with them. This is your mother. She just wants to leave us here. No, no way. Listen, it will be best for everyone. How? Okay? How would it be good for you to go up and, and, and no one be there when... No, 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 that's not the best. That's not the best. Mika, Mika. I know this is hard to hear, but it is the truth. When I die, I will not be myself. Whether or not you guys are there with me, I will die alone. Hannah OD'd. You know, if I hadn't found her, she would have died. They had to pump her stomach. Is she okay? Well, she'll live. But I'm still trying to figure out how she got her hands on those pills. Well, you're right about one thing. No one's ever going to believe her story because, well, no one's ever going to hear it. Wait, what do you mean? Let's just say Hannah has been dealt with. Uh, they sure it would have been a suicide? What else would it be? I don't know. It's just messed up, even for Hannah. Yeah, it just doesn't add up. What do you mean? Well, I spent a lot of time with Hannah before she confessed. We were on the road together, we talked a lot, and not once did she mention you. So? It just didn't make sense that she would attack you. I mean, a lot of things were bugging her, but not you. You don't believe that. I just want to hear it from you. What? Tell me exactly what happened the night she attacked you. Pretty twisted, huh? I'm crazy about the girl who shot me. Yes, it is. That's why you should go. If being into you is crazy, I don't want to be sane. <laughs> Did you really just say that? You uh, just sounded crazier than when you were trying to be all gangster. I'm not good at lines. You're making me feel really stupid right now. God, this is bad. Okay, that's why you should go. No. It, it, how can I go? Look what you're doing to me. I have a boyfriend. Do you want that boyfriend? This is unbelievable. Okay, I'll go if you want me to, but... You need to tell me which star's throwing me out. <sighs> which star? Yeah. I mean, there are two of you. The girl that I met at the park, she was all emo, and she was sad and lonely, but that girl that I went on the run with, I mean, she was kick-ass, and she was passionate, and, and she... She twinkled. And my bet, that's original recipe star. And there's no sign of that girl when Cole's around. Y you, you don't... You don't know. Maybe. Maybe you're right. But if you give me one shot, I can tell you this much. I'll have one thought every morning that I wake up. That is to make sure that that sad and lonely star never shows her face again.